check out Tesla's Optimus Generation 2. It's mind-blowing. So welcome back to Infinite Innovation Tech. In this video, we want to explain why this is the real deal regarding AI and robotics, primarily for Tesla fans. We'll dive into the trailer, uncover some hidden details, and explore why Optimus 2 is the future. Now, with Optimus Generation 2, it's a whole new ballgame. This robot is strutting its stuff entirely autonomously. No strings attached, literally. Most robots in development are usually held up by something like a security blanket to avoid them stumbling and taking a beating during the learning phase. And you know how it goes. Humanoid robots are pricey investments, not your everyday computer or phone. We're talking big bucks, hundreds of thousands of dollars. So showing us that these robots can function without any support is a huge deal. It means the development is way further along than we might have thought. But wait, there's more. Improved balance and full body control take the spotlight in this Optimus 2 reveal. And let's talk about those hands. Seriously, it's mind blowing. Join us as we unravel the excitement around Tesla's Optimus 2 and what it means for the future of AI and robotics. Let's talk about those faster hands. They're game changers. And here's why it's a big deal. First, many robot demos out there are painfully slow, like watching paint dry. Take Google's Palmy robot, for instance. It's cool, but moves at a snail's pace. The previous Tesla Optimus, on the other hand, breaks that mold. What you see is real time, and man, it's lightning fast. We haven't come across a robot that quickly before. Here's the exciting part. We hope this isn't some VR teleop magic. VR teleop, for those not in the know, is where you use a VR headset like the MetaQuest to control a robot at lightning speed. It's a common trick in robotics to get that precise movement and agility. We'll show you some clips of the VR teleop in action, but fingers crossed, Tesla confirms this isn't what's happening. If it's not VR teleop, it's a whole new insane level. It means these folks at Tesla are pushing the boundaries with their advanced speed and agility in moving the robot. We can't wait to see where this takes us. But you know what's wild? Most robot demos are like watching a movie on fast forward, at least two or three times the speed. But not this one. If this isn't sped up, we're in for a treat because that means it's got some serious potential. Imagine a robot that moves as fast as we do. A game changer. Now let's talk about the need for speed. Many robots stroll at a snail's pace, and that's been a buzzkill. Even a modest 20% improvement, getting robots to move as fast as us, would be a giant leap forward. Slow, inefficient bots don't cut it, but if we crack the code and get them zooming around like the Flash, that's a game changer. But here's the real kicker delicate object manipulation. Sure, other robots have pulled off this stunt and we'll show you some clips in a bit. But let's appreciate that getting a robot to handle fragile stuff with finesse is crucial. Stick around. We've got some excellent clips of other robots showcasing their skills in this department too. Check out this sanctuary AI robot handling an egg. It's incredible, correct? No offense to the Tank Show AI team, but Tesla's robot takes the cake. Placing an egg delicately is no small feat, and Tesla's robot nails it with that gentle touch and precision. And get this, it's not just about handling it gently, but also placing it in the right spot. That's some next level finesse that shouldn't go unnoticed. Now let's talk about the bigger picture. What's mind blowing is that we're witnessing this incredible feat and the pace at which it's happening. A few months ago, it was Tesla generation one, and here we are with generation two. What's even crazier is that other companies are jumping on the bandwagon. The other day, a company released a robot strikingly similar to Tesla's Optimus. Coincidence or shared engineering brilliance? Who knows? But it's sparking quite a debate online about the future of humanoid robots. Buckle up because things are getting seriously exciting in the world of robotics. The race among various companies to develop their versions of humanoid robots is heating up and becoming quite intriguing. While some might argue that walking in these demos isn't perfect, it still gives us a glimpse of the crazy capabilities these robots possess. Now let us show you some other robots in development because when we evaluate the Tesla Optimus video, we compare it to the rest of the robotic world. And honestly, kudos to Tesla's design team. Their futuristic look is top notch. A sleek and modern design isn't underestimated. It dramatically adds to the overall effectiveness. Of course, we can only dive into the world of robots by mentioning Boston Dynamics, but here's the kicker. We genuinely believe that Tesla's Optimus is a different beast than Boston Dynamics Atlas. And let's be honest, the design of the Tesla bot is on another level. 
Major props to the team for making it functional and aesthetically pleasing. Atlas has been developing for quite some time and is often touted as one of the most advanced robots globally. However, it's essential to note that Atlas is less humanoid than some other robots. It lacks hands and fingers, and its perspective on the world is likely different. In contrast, the Tesla bot serves a different purpose with its humanoid design. While Atlas is impressive, there must be more certainty about when it will transition into full-scale production for factory use. Despite the excellent and visually appealing demonstrations, it's crucial to recognize that many are just demos. If you explore Boston Dynamics' official page, you'll find instances where they must rerun simulations multiple times to ensure adequate performance because the robot encounters failures. In essence, while Atlas is advanced and promising, it's still a work in progress. And there's plenty of refinement needed before it becomes a fully completed and reliable product. Of course, it's the hardware, not the software. We want to share another company's progress with you, Unri. They've made significant strides in developing their humanoid robot. You can even kick the robot, and it manages to stand up, which is quite impressive. Despite lacking hands and a complete figure, this robot is intriguing, especially considering its affordability. We such robots might find use in specific towns and areas due to their cost effectiveness and versatility in performing various tasks. At the same time, we are uncertain about their specific roles, whether they're patrolling or something else. The future seems genuinely fascinating. You should check out the evolution of large language models, LLMs. In a recent video, we discussed Google's Gemini and how they plan to integrate it into giant language model robots. This video explores how these models are embedded in robots, promising a unique interaction with them. Let us show you a quick video to illustrate how these large language models, currently dominating the internet, are shaping the future. Large language models embodied in physical agents or robots create a buzz due to their ability to interact with the world. These agents derive excitement from interpreting commands and context based on their extensive language models, incorporating elements like pop culture references. For instance, the example of Digit identifying Darth Vader's red lightsaber and a red box in its surroundings showcases this capability. What makes this development intriguing is the prospect of robots having their thoughts, enabling them to make decisions autonomously. The idea of a robot processing information, like recognizing the color of a lightsaber and choosing actions accordingly, represents the next stage in the evolution of large language models and robotics. This ability to think and strategize using language models is considered the future. Google's DeepMind, the company behind projects like AlphaFold and AlphaGo, introduces Gemini as a new breed of AI. Gemini aims to be genuinely multimodal by incorporating touch and tactile feedback. Their article highlights Google's exploration of applying foundational models to robotics, emphasizing the potential of combining language models with physical actions. The discussion also touches on Google's previous AI model, G, which is capable of diverse tasks, and the project RT2, where large language models assist robots in understanding and performing actions. The article suggests that breakthroughs in projects like Tesla's bot could significantly impact the world, attracting attention and investment for their transformative potential. The hope is that continued advancements will turn these concepts into reality, ushering in a new era in robotics. And that's a wrap for today. What are your thoughts on the rapid advancements in humanoid robots and the integration of large language models? Do you see these innovations as a game changer? Or do you have reservations about the pace of development? Drop your comments below. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to stay tuned for more cutting-edge tech insights. Until next time, see you in the future.